The make noise fixed filter divides any sound into six pieces, isolating different portions of the sonic spectrum from each other. There are two inputs corresponding to two different filter responses. 6 dB has a smoother slope and less resonance, while 12 dB has a steeper slope and more resonance. Simply patch your sound into either of the inputs and it will have its components distributed across the six outputs in a range of roughly six octaves. Both inputs can be used simultaneously. The fixed filter is a powerful tool for parallel processing, making it easy to apply effects such as those in the echophone and herb verb to only whatever spectral portion of sound you choose. For example, I'll patch a couple different outputs through the echophone here, and then mix it back in with the unfiltered patch, and we can hear the variety available. Also, because the two inputs are simultaneously available, the fixed filter can easily be used in feedback patches. Here I'll run the feedback out of the echophone back into the fixed filter to create a feedback loop. Watch the input level closely to avoid things getting out of hand. We could also take an additional output to the echophone feedback input and get a little crazier. The fixed filter also allows you to turn any type of patch into one that is frequency dependent. For example, we could use it to apply FM to the right side of the DPO only when the left side is in a certain frequency range. We'll patch the VCOA output through the fixed filter, pick a band and start modulating it. The FM index goes up as the frequency nears the selected band. It's also a powerful tool for creating percussion. A complex sound, especially one with elements of noise in it, can sound like different percussive elements when sliced into spectral pieces. For example, here's a heavy sound using cross-modulation on the DPO. Run it through the fixed filter and into a couple channels of the Optimix, and we have something like a couple of drum sounds which we can then sequence with Rene. Sequencing parameters on the DPO itself alongside will give us room for quite a bit of variation.
The fixed filter can be connected to a Ritz mix for an easy way to scan, blend, and animate the different outputs, but even on its own it can be a fun addition to a modular system. Visit makenoisemusic.com for more information.